The All Progressives Congress APC in River State has revealed that the attack on the Secretariat last week Wednesday was planned to disrupt its delegates Congress ahead of the party's primaries. The party disclosed this to newsmen during a news briefing in Port Harcourt, the River State capital, the report. The party's publicity secretary in the state, Chris Feinborn, who debunked reports that the security men invited to disperse a crowd during the attack killed one of the protesters and said that the mob made an attempt to stop materials from leaving the party secretariat. He said the party invited the security personnel to avoid a repeat of what happened to the party in River State in 2018. Reflecting deeply on the incident, we have come to the conclusion that the mob was deliberately assembled and sent to block the party gates as early as 6 a.m. to ensure that materials for the Congresses were not sent to the 319 words for the Congresses. Unknown to them, there was no such materials to be moved to the words apart from a small slip or recorded results in each word. We believe the police account that no one died, despite that the patience of the police was stretched to its elastic limit by the violent conduct of the mob. The sponsors of the mob are still flying the narrative that Congresses did not take place. But much of the world now know that that is not the case. Feinborn also said that the party is fully ready and prepared for the primaries, having conducted the Delegates Congress. Much to the disappointment of the mob and their sponsors, the World and LDA Congresses took place peacefully and transparently across the 319 was fully observed by officials of the Independent Electoral Commission and security officials, except one. And that one exception is uh, in Asaritor, Asaritor LGA, where the returning officers and egos of Asaritor could not do their work because of violence. Despite the unfortunate incident on Wednesday, we believe that our march towards participating in the next stage of the electioneering calendar, which is the primaries, will proceed at pace without let. We hope to ultimately build on this momentum to achieve our overall objective of winning the 2023 elections. Party leaders from the 20 local government areas of the state attended the briefing. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.